Hello guys, welcome well, welcome back to my videos. Today we guys five broken Ryuji Kenichi combos. So if you guys enjoyed this video, remember that like button to click out more. Let's get right to the video, guys. All right, so we're gonna start off with this combo, the It's Fundo combo. It's gonna be the two move one shot combo, including Shindai Ren third move and Ryuji Kenichi Z spec. To do this combo, all you need to do is use Shindai Ren third move, and they'll actually hit you after the Shindai Ren third move if you time it correctly. Then you guys want to use the Z spec, and that's it. That's all it's going to take to one-shot someone, as long as all the clones hit properly. That is all it will take to one-shot. And yeah, it's very, very busted. I'm only going to do this once and not twice like I normally do, because, you know, you get the point. It's two moves. Alright, so as you guys just saw, I did the Z-Spec. Now, I'm going to show you guys a different version of the combo that does not include mode, in case you guys want to use this in competitive, or you want to use this in RPG without a mode. Alright, so as I said before, you guys want to use the third move, and the third move will actually hit you, and then you guys want to use Kenichi third move. Make sure you hit the th Kenichi third move correctly, then immediately use Kenichi first move. And if you guys use the Kenichi first move correctly, then you guys would use Shindai Ren first move. And if you guys do this combo correctly, it will one shot. And it is true, guys, you cannot do anything in the middle of if you use all the abilities correctly. And I will do it for you guys again. Alright, so as I said before, you guys would use the third move. They will actually hit you. Make sure to use Kenichi third move on them. And then you guys would use the Kenichi first move. After the Kenichi first move, you guys just want to immediately use Shindai Ren first move. And boom, it would be a one shot if all the abilities combined correctly. It's a very quick to cool combo and overall is very, very good. Alright, so the next time I show you guys be Ten Goku and Ryuji. You just got to be using Fireworks of Jutsu, Combo Breaker, and Acrobat Style. Alright, to start off the combo, you guys want to actually break their block with Fireworks. So she, she's going to go ahead and simulate being, you know, blocking. You guys want him with Fireworks of Jutsu, immediately use Raiji Kenichi first ability. After the Raiji Kenichi first ability lands, you guys want to use the third ability on them. After the third ability lands, they will get knocked back and you guys want to use Acrobat Style. As they get hit from Acrobat Style, you guys want to use the 10 Goku Beam. Immediately use Combo Breaker after that. And if you guys time this all correctly, you should be able to use Fireworks Jutsu again at the end of the combo. And they will actually be one shot. I'll do that again for you guys, just to show you guys again. So I'm going to break her block with Fireworks Jutsu. I'm going to go ahead and use Raiji Kenichi first ability. Raiji Kenichi first ability is going to be landing. Immediately use Raiji Kenichi third ability on them. Raiji Kenichi third ability is going to be landing. They'll get knocked back. Immediately use Acrobat Style. Acrobat Style missed. Normally it doesn't miss if you wait a second. And then after Acrobat Style, you guys would use 10 Goku Beam. 10 Goku Beam will go on. And then you guys would use Combo Breaker into Fireworks Jutsu. And if you guys don't miss the Acrobat Style, it will actually be a one-shot combo. And overall, this combo is actually very, very strong. As you guys can see, the only issue is if the Acrobat Style doesn't land. But if you guys wait a second and inch forward a, a bit, you'll be able to hit the Acrobat Style every single time. Alright guys, so the next combo is going to be Senko and Ryuji Kenichi. You just got to be using Combo Breaker, Ryan Barrage, Ember Entry, and Acrobat. And as you guys can say, see, this doesn't use any Bloodline slots on the right side whatsoever. Alright, to start off the combo, you guys want to use Senko first ability to Raiju Kenichi first ability. After Raiju Kenichi first ability lands, you guys want to actually use Raiju Kenichi third ability. Third ability will go backwards, immediately use Acrobat style. Three on once, one, two, three. Oh, I didn't do three, I did two, that's fine. Combo Breaker. 3M1s, go into Ryan Barrage, immediately use Ember Entry, make sure to go straight downwards, do a full M1 combo, Senko first ability into a full M1 combo. And then you guys, if you guys don't actually land the M1s there, you can immediately use Acrobat Style and it will actually be a one shot. And this is actually an infinite combo, not that infinites are really a thing in the game anymore because auto dodgers are so prevalent, but this can be an infinite combo if that interests you. I'll do one more time for you guys. Alright, so as I said before, you want to use Senko first ability to Raiju Kenichi first ability. After Raiju Kenichi first ability actually lands, you want to use Raiju Kenichi first, I mean third ability. Third ability will be landing Acrobat style on them. One, two, three, three M1s, combo breaker. Three more M1s. One, two, three. And then you guys want to use Ryan Barrage. Immediately use Ember Entry, go straight downwards. Then you guys would do another full M1 combo. Senko first ability, another full M1 combo into Acrobat style. And as I said before, guys, it is a one shot and it is an infinite combo if that interests you guys. Alright, guys, so next up is actually going to be Ryuji Bankai, but this one's going to be really weird. You're going to need Thunder Ken or Shiver Ken and MMA. This is going to be one of the weird combos. I know some of you guys actually like the weird combos you used to make, so this is for you guys. Alright, so to do this combo, you guys want to actually use Thunder Ken's second ability. Thunder Ken's second ability, you want to do a full M1 combo into the weapon spec. After the weapon spec, you would do another full M1 combo. Immediately use Raiji Kenichi first ability after you land that. After it actually lands, use the Bankai third ability. Wait for it to land, use Bankai second ability. Run forward, do a full M1 combo. Into the weapon spec, into combo breaker. After combo breaker, they should be dead, but in case they're not dead, obviously you can finish off with one more M1 combo and they will be dead. And I'll do that one more time for you guys. And as I said before, this is a really weird and cool combo. And... I'm probably actually going to be using this. So if you guys see me using this, very fun. Alright, so as I said before, you guys want to use Thundercat's second ability. We'll actually land, hit a full 
M1 combo on them. Use the weapon spec. Do another full M1 combo on them. Use Raiju Kenichi first ability. Raiju Kenichi first ability land. Immediately use Bankai third ability. It will actually land. Immediately use Bankai second ability. Run forward. Full M1 combo on them. Use the weapon spec again. And then use combo breaker. And then you guys can use the weapon spec again. Not the weapon spec. You guys would do just another full M1 combo. And yeah, this is a very fun and creative and cool combo overall. Anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, remember that like button's going to come more. See you next time, guys. Bye-bye.